Black Lives Matter protesters packed the parking lot of the Park Avenue High V store in Des Moines today. KCCI's Chris Gothner is live there tonight and Chris, they say that they are upset about what they say happened to an employee after she attended a Black Lives Matter rally. Yeah, they do say that, Max. This store is closed right now, and in fact, it has been boarded up for the night. Max, the protesters do say, though, that those empl that employee was asked to work in the back of this store here, the Park Avenue High V, after attending a Black Lives Matter rally. Jess Murray Johnson alleges that she was told by a manager that we she was, quote, hired to work, not to protest. Black Lives Matter protesters say it's part of a bigger problem, and they'll continue to boycott High V if that behavior continues. They're also calling for raises for employees working during COVID and calling for the company to end racism and sexual harassment. KCCI spoke to community activist and pastor Rob Johnson outside the protest earlier today. This is about making a statement. This is about telling companies do not discriminate against African Americans. Don't employers do not hold African Americans back. And if somebody chooses to exercise their right to protest, that's their right. Whether you agree with it or not, that's still their right. Now, Hy-Vee released a statement in response to these allegations. The full statement's on our KCCI mobile app, but in part, it reads, we have tried multiple times to speak with Jazz Murray, Jazzy Johnson, to discuss her situation, but to no avail. Now, Hy-Vee adds that Johnson and the Black Lives Matter organization have not been communicating with the company until today's protest. The chain also said she was asked to work in the aisles online section for one day while the SOAR needed help. Now, there were some instances today of at least one person trying to drive through a group of protesters. There was also an instance today of some demonstrators vandalizing a Des Moines police car. Live on the south side of Des Moines, Chris Gopner, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.